please take change as an example to talk about the competitiveness and advantages of how Zhejiang private enterprises win in this world. I remember uh, back 1997, the first time that our Chin sent the small team went to the Brazil. Brazil, you know, in South America, it's really far away. And we start to build our business in that area. It was such a far place, uh, starting from zero, from the scratch, right? Exactly. And then, you know, in Brazil, they don't speak English. How can you communicate with that? <laughs> Never give up easily and continually to do that. Once they decided, we make uh, and uh, always make things happen. And I think the re resilience, they have very strong uh, belief. So our team, once they stayed in Brazil, they surpassed the, you know, the financial crisis in 1998. And nobody, I, I can say most of the company and the people, they feel depressed. But our team, we consisted to do that. That is Zhejiang spirit. Zhejiang spirit mm. encourage us. Mm -mm. So I think this case will show you mm -mm. what Zhejiang spirit it is. Right. So, <laughs> so for your personal experience, you have been committed to the internationalization of chain business for a lot of years. So for your future goals, what kind of uh, international image would you like, would, would you like change to have in the world? Yes, what kind of image? I think change will must be a company which wins the respect from the competitors and become the great brand in the electrical uh, industry field. Yes, that's what I want. And uh, talk about the international uh, internationalization. Um, yeah, I think I do have some experience to share with you. Firstly, when we do the global business, it doesn't only means to export or sell the goods to the other countries. It's not only sales or the export and import, but it's like uh, deliver the behavior, deliver the main side, deliver the brand. And the customer, they will feel, they will feel your company and through your product, through your attitude, through your service. So if the Chinese company want to create a big brand, create a good reputation in the world, they must learn how to respect, how to respect the culture, how to respect the market, how to respect the client, and also do a lot of deeper analysis to understand the real requirement. So, uh, plus, uh, not only this is a good product, not only good the team, but also the open mind, the mindset, change the mindset, and not only get the benefits from the business, but also create some social responsibility. So if we can do this, we will win the respect and we will create the great name, also the brand. Talk about the social responsibility, I will share you one good news. Last month, we just participated in the United Union, the Global Compact. This is an organization that will uh, to support uh, to the future development and uh, cons consistently, uh, sustainably uh, developing. So we are the Chinese company which participated in this organization. They sent an email to me. So it's very, um, it's not only the certificate, but it's a kind of for the improvement uh, that we are, we take our responsibilities. Yeah, it's a very good news I would like to share with you. Yeah. Okay. Glad to hear that.
In the industrial internet era, Zhejiang's enterprises have responded to and implemented Project One for the digital economy and persist in technological innovation and transformational development, so as to lay the groundwork for the high-quality development of Zhejiang and lead the digitization and the coordinated innovation of industry chains and industrial clusters. Let's look forward to the emergence of more internationalized, intelligent, and digitalized enterprises in Zhejiang.